Tow lines or tugger cart systems are the lifeblood of many different companies. Without tow lines, the whole operation will break down. These tow lines are composed of carts, and on these carts, casters connect the whole operation to the ground. If these casters fail, the whole operation fails. Because of how important casters are, we need to make sure that the casters will handle the unique requirements of tow lines. There are four main issues when choosing casters for tugger systems. Load. Plainly put, you have to make sure that your casters will handle the weight that you'll be transporting. To get a quick load rating for your casters, use the rule of three. Take all of the weight being moved, the cart, and the load weight, and then divide this by three, which is the number of casters. We use three rather than four to give us a safety buffer, and sometimes your cart will only be on three wheels. This will give you your weight load requirements per wheel, and we post the ratings per caster in our catalog and online for three miles per hour, or walking speed. For example, consider a 300 pound cart with an 1800 pound load on it. This would be 2100 pounds divided by three. Each caster would have to support, or be rated for, 700 pounds or more for this load. Speed's effect. Speed plays a huge role in calculating load rating. The faster your cart moves, the more load capacity you need your casters to support. For example, casters that normally have a sufficient weight load rating at walking pace will be around 20% too low when you increase your speed to around 5 miles per hour. So for casters rated at 700 pounds, you'll need casters that can support 840 pounds at this speed. Speed and duty cycle. Duty cycle is an important factor when it comes to speed. As your casters move, they generate heat. In tow lines, you need to rest your carts before you go to the next task. This is the duty cycle. Different caster technologies and materials will help you to be able to move more continuously over the day. So you should consider this factor when selecting your casters, or you may find yourself resting your carts too often. Tread. Tread is extremely important for tow lines. Our choice for caster tread is Shore A polyurethane that has the proper amount of compression. Polyurethane also grips the ground, absorbs shock, resists tearing, and repels debris. Hard wheels on the Shore D scale, such as nylon, steel, and phenolic, create a major sliding hazard, floor damage, and noise. Bearings. Bearings in tow lines have to handle the speed and stress of heavy loads. We never use caged roller bearings for tugger systems. We use precision ball bearings which are many times larger and are therefore much more durable under the rigors of a tow line. Swivel Fork Tugger systems need rigs that have extended leads. An extended lead simply increases the angle of the fork. This gets rid of caster flutter because you're giving the caster room to trail properly. This keeps your equipment and casters in better working order and prevents other issues from occurring. Caster Raceway A raceway is the part of your caster where the rig bearing moves, normally in 360 degrees, and is extremely important in tow line casters. When your caster raceway fails while you transport products in a tow line, you risk injury to employees, damage to goods, and downtime in general. Certain designs are not suitable for tow lines such as the standard kingpin rig with its kingpin and ball bearings. The kingpin can't handle the stress and rigors of towing speeds and forces. The kingpin will stretch and or snap, causing the swivel raceway to fail. Use a raceway that is strong enough to handle the demands of a tow line such as a kingpinless raceway or a forged kingpin raceway. Both of these raceways have a superior design to remove the failure point of a small standard kingpin. When you select your caster wheels and rigs, consider all of these factors so that you can be more productive and efficient. This will help you avoid downtime and swapping out new wheels or caster rigs. On top of these factors, you also need to select the right design features such as a donut versus flat or slightly crowned tread and maintenance free versus king pinless rigs. You can see these differences in our CC Apex, CC Apex HD, and CC Stark. If you want help working through this process, feel free to reach out to us. Thanks again.